A makeshift camp has been set up in the stifling heat of the Burma jungle. About 15 years ago, small fields of easily extractable oil were discovered here. An old motor patched up with some cables is all it takes to look for the black gold. It lies just 200 meters below ground. People from all over Burma have come looking for it. Amongst them, Mr. Fengi. I used to be able to get 40 liters of petrol a day, but it's become less and less. Now it's just eight liters a day. Mr. Fengi used to deal in precious stones before the market declined, so he's invested all his savings in oil. I invested in labor and machinery, in equipment, food, everything. I sell my petrol and my employees get a fixed wage. I invested 800 euros in two years, and thanks to oil, I've made my money back. Now, you've seen the quality of my petrol. You can put it straight into the engine. Hardly need to refine it at all. There isn't enough oil to interest the big multinationals or the state, and they leave it for the people to reap the benefits. Thousands make a living from this cottage industry. Once extracted, the crude oil is stocked in 25-litre barrels, which are fastened onto motorbikes and delivered to the refinery. I've loaded about 25 litres on my motorbike. If it's dry and the road's good, I won't fall off. With his explosive cargo, the tanker biker has 15 hazardous kilometers to the nearest wholesaler. He earns 2,500 Burmese kyats for each trip, about two euros. The oil is then transported to Moriwa, the closest town. This is the refinery. No chimneys, no giant reservoirs, just petrol cans. The owner insists his product is as good as any of the big companies and much cheaper. Our petrol is sold all over Burma. We deliver it everywhere, even to the big cities, such as Yangon and Mandalay. A lot of people use our petrol. Production is basic. The petrol is heated in a large vat. As it heats up, the crude oil turns into gas and, when cooled, resumes its liquid form. The lighter it is, the better its quality. Look at the color. It's yellow. But soon it will become clean and clear. It's good petrol and we'll refine it still further. The small refinery can produce up to 20,000 tons of petrol a month. It will sell for about 75 cents a litre, twice as cheap as in Europe. 